Welcome inside the KFC Yum Center, the palatial new home of the Louisville Cardinals. Tonight, it's number 21 Louisville against the Drexel Dragons out of the Colonial Athletic Association against UNLV. And Rick Pitino saying definitely uh, outside of Butler, the best team he's seen so far this year. At least played against. Yeah. Left-handed, high off the window, and that's uh, Sammy Gibbons. Big win for Oakland. Uh, if you just joined us, uh, Oakland uh, knocking off Tennessee. That is a three ball for Coles, his second. Passing it with four. Thomas knocks down a three. Inside ten seconds now. Down to five. Fouch steps back, knocks down a huge three for Chris Fouch. His second, and they beat the buzzer. And it gives Drexel a two-point lead headed for the locker room and a big mental lift. Knowles back on him. Three on the shot clock. Little runner by Coles kisses it off the window. Nice touch. He's in double figures with 10. The problem, I think, is though there's not a lot of back-to-the-basket opportunities out of this offense. There's a block on the other end this time. Sammy Gibbons and Drexel says, hey, we can run. Fouch. Nice move. Fouch with eight points in the game. Boy, not too many open looks. Coles rips it for three. We've got the size advantage on him. Patino wanting him to play defense. He's not hitting the shots. Two. One on the clock. And the lefty, uh, Sammy Gibbons, finally knocks it down. He's just slowed down a bit. Drexel's getting some good looks inside. Hitting their outside shots. Here's another one. And with a flush there, it's an 8-0 run now by the Dragons. To just harp on you as the game goes on, you start making lazy passes, lazy cuts, and they get the steals. Sammy Givens now with eight points, six in the second half. And they've worked out. They've done a nice job on foul. Formborg, not known for his offense. Oh, he kisses it off the window. He's not a go-to guy on this team yet. That's going to be it. For Gerald Coles, a three-year starter. And the senior captain knocks down 20 points. And Rick Pitino suffers his first loss of this season. They go to 8-1. and one. Drexel now 7-1. and one. So Bruiser Flint, that we mentioned earlier in the broadcast, back in the 06-07 season, they went on the road, beat Villanova. They went into the Carrier Dome, beat Syracuse. Well, now they come into this palatial Yum Center and hand the Louisville Cardinals their first loss in this brand-new building. 52-46. to 46. Bruiser Flint with a huge win. And a huge win for the Colonial Athletic Association as well. All right, thanks, Mike. Coach, what an incredible performance by your guys. What stands out to you, the way your guys played, handled the pressure of this Louisville team? Well, we, we were defending and we rebounded. To be honest with you, that's what it came down to. It. You know, we got stops and rebounds. We kept on the second shots. We got the pace of the game the way we wanted it. We didn't run up and down. We want to run up and down with them. And, and we defended and rebounded. I mean, we, we made it a little interesting at the end. Uh, we were a little scattered, but we, we catted at our pace, and we defended and rebounded against them. Fouch is your leading scorer, but he didn't go off tonight. Instead, it was the senior, Gerald Coates, who played a great game. What, did, what was it about his game that allowed him him to play the way he did. He played like a senior. I mean, that's what you got to do. Uh, um, you know, and he played with some, he played with poise. He settled us down, and he made some big shots for us and made some big foul shots. A lot of foul trouble for your team, but you're able to persevere throughout that. What a great performance, especially by your big guys down low as well on the glass. Yeah, well, and I told you that at the shoot around, and I thought actually our advantage was inside. <laughs> But uh, those guys got a little foul trouble. Yannick came and gave us some big minutes, but we battled. Like I said, we just defended, rebounded, play with heart. Uh, congrats, Coach. Go get in that locker room. Enjoy with your team. Follow all the action of CAA basketball online at caasports.com.